Hello everyone, I'm the Cremulant Archer, and welcome to Soul Trader. Um, Soul Trader is a new game coming out on June 6th, I believe, it's a Monday. Um, and it is, and one of the things I read about it, it was described as War Fortress meets Elite Dangerous. Um, it is a space trading and combat game, um, with a top-down perspective, as you can probably see from this, uh, this little start landing screen that we're on right now, but with a whole, like... 200 years of time is, is perceived generally generated before you start the game and then things go there and there's like important relationships that make a difference in how things play and all that kind of good stuff. I have not played this at all yet, so we're going to play it together. So let's start a new game. <clears throat> Alright, to begin we generate 200 years of history for your gain. Choose how old you want your character to be at the start of the game You can choose your parents and part of your own history. Let's start at... Let's see, that's random seed, that's fine. Older characters are more experienced and well-connected, or they are more likely to have had injuries or made enemies. Let's start... We'll go with the default there, we'll start at 25. <clears throat> escape capsules. Allows players to escape to the nearest planet when the ship blows up. What fun is that? No... Peaceful mode? No... Generate. In the end, it's not the years of your life that counts, it's the life in your years. Alright, so... Things are being generated right now. I don't entirely know what's happening. I think this is the 200 years that's being uh, generated here. We'll just wait for it to finish. Find out what happens. 75%. Just trying to read little bits of this as it pops along. There's the diet age. Alright, choose your parents. We got, um, I gotta turn my headphones down real quick, excuse me guys. There we go. Alright, so we got Gwyn Farmer and Isa Conaway, which are... Gwyn is very scrawny and weak indeed, slower than, is slower moving than average, and is slow to tire. She is quite quit, witted, is generally sensible and trustworthy, charming and witty. She is well off financially and somewhat known in the orbital. She is originally from Frontier Space, age 50, Frontier Space Visa. Extremely strong and muscle, muscular is lean, very agile. He's average mind, sensible and repellent. He's most sensible and is repellent to everyone with no social skills at all. He's very poor and is somewhat known in the prime. Alright, so we got someone who is rich and weak and smart, and someone who is poor and poorly, no good socials and stuff. And we got... Uh, Sandy is surprisingly strong, limber and quick. Legendary stamina. She is much slower to catch on. She's extremely wise, loyal, sensible, and charming and witty. Well off financially. This guy's bitterly poor. Saw that here. Uh, his normal build, legendary reflexes, average stamina. I kind of like these people. Quick-witted, sensible. They're both uh, both quick, which I like the sound of. Is surprisingly strong as of a legendary reflexes and average stamina is often in need of extra help to understand things. It's very steady, sensible life of life and soul of the party is well known. He's extremely wealthy and is somewhat known in London. He's originally from the old federation. Alright. And this guy is Oh, I did the wrong person. That was Roosevelt. This is Catherine. Scrawny and weak. Slower to catch on. She's short of money. That's eh, fine. Alright, so what do we got here? Fit and strong, is clumsy and always breaking things, is tough and never ill, he is often in need of extra help in understanding things, he's very bitterly poor, she is poor, alright, I'm going to choose these two with their weird eye thing going on, um, I don't know who, I guess these are just other people around, we're going to be the the child of Sadie Bradley and Murray Bysouth. Um, I guess I was born a boy. I guess it doesn't really matter, but whatever. Born a boy. Murray became the father of Felix. Okay, I'm Felix Bradley. This is you. Location not known. All right. Felix was raised with an older sister. I have an older sister, Jacqueline. Another older sister, Julie. Another older sister, Provincia. Uh, that's my mom. All right. I look most after their... What could you... Took most after their father, took most after... I don't remember what our, the difference between our people. Uh, let's take most after our mother. 
Here's what happens next. Struggled with gym work, struggled with craft, struggled with running games, struggled with mathematics, struggled with listening to teachers, struggled with hanging out with friends. Um, <clears throat> let's struggle with running games. Felix was disappointed when he heard about, when they heard, wait, let's look at this stuff real quick here. All right, so we got some grandparents. Felix was disappointed when they heard about when Sadie covered up their incompetence at something bank. Harryman nephew. All right, so she's she has uh, not been doing well at her job. Felix was disappointed when they heard about Sadie covered up their incompetence at Port Fira. All right, she's and we've got a friend, Maxine. What happens next? All right, we worked hardest at gym work. We worked hardest running games. We worked hardest at mathematics. We worked hardest at crafts. So we struggled with something. I wonder if we work hard at the thing we struggled at, if that would give us a good, like, something. But I'm going to work hardest at listening to the teachers. All right. Felix and Maxine became friends. Good listening to teachers. We moved to Carol Lowen. I don't know where that is. Somewhere on that planet, whatever it is. Mercury. Oh, it's a place on Mercury. All right. Um, how do I go back? There. Ooh, I'm like, I've got a porn stash going on there. <laughs> I don't know how old I am now. Um, what happens next? Didn't get a job. Went back to retake exams. Became a check-in assistant. Took a job cleaning. Became a security guard. Apprenticeship as a mechanic. Management trainee. Courier, assembly worker, apprenticeship, mechanic. Man, that's a lot of these. Um, I'm going to be a courier at the Takendo Incorporated. Yeah, let's do that. Oop, oh, a bunch of stuff just happened. Oh, I wanted to read that. Enough is enough. You're fed up with regular life, going through the motions like everyone else. You decided to make your own way in the world. It's time for you to... Use all those connections and contacts you've gathered before you. Your life mission will be become president. Okay, I'm going to become president. Um, we have to change our name, though. Our name is not Felix. Our name is C. Archer. C. Archer Bradley. Become the, the leader of the old federation. All right. Wait. Oh, we can change these? Explore the whole s asteroid miner. Um, uh, we'll leave it at become president. Why not? I don't know what I'm doing, so we'll figure it out. <laughs> Start the game. Begin recorded message. Hello, is this thing on? I hope you can hear me. I've never been much good at these things. It's your father here. I'm going off planet tomorrow, and I won't be back for a while. Don't worry, it's not that dangerous. At least I hope not. Anyway, oh, anyway, I've been meaning to do this for ages in case something happens, which it won't. I've decided to create to, to create you a little guidance to help figure out life, city, and move on. Here's a piece of advice: life is all about people and relationships. Yep. No, you might want to explore the whole system or take the top career, fly the best, blah blah blah. Uh, however, to achieve these goals, you'll need to learn lean on networks of friends relationships i can teach you how comes with some quick pointers to get a ship you can borrow one by talking to a close friend or relative or hire one or buy one the local spaceport is time going by while i'm doing this I think time might be going by to hire a ship you'll need money take loans if there aren't any banks available you can get can't get credit but there's always a local crime syndicates be wary though once you have a ship, you can trade goods at the city markets, do you a favor, and conduct missions. Those are the basics. You can get clothes now and view city. All right. Yeah, we'll figure it out together. It's quiet here. All right, so let's see. So this is all the other stuff. Wait, I bought, I bought Defiant Radiant. What is this? Huh. Traded in the, to the local shipyard. Oh, I, I had a ship and then I sold it. Is the like, um, 
thing here. All right, so let's look at the v city. Lightly populated mining outpost, mostly buried below the furnace that is Mercury's surface. Let's just we visit us. That's just that. All right. Let's call. Let's actually call our sister, shall we? Oh wait, where'd my sister go? Oh, she left. Oh, people come and go. Okay, I see. It's our previous ships. This is what we owned before the game started. All right, people. Inconsequential, wealthy, and unreliable. Influential, wealthy, top mechanic. Reliable and influential. Can we call her? Apparently you can't call them. All right. So let's see. What else do we need to do here? We got some friends. Let's go to the spaceport. Make sure you're difficult to share low. All right. Your mother... Sibling's friend at front desk. Cleaner, repairing ship. Your sister at front desk. Let's talk to our sister. Hi. What can I do for you? Um, I want a ship. Can I borrow a ship? Okay, sure. Let me help you out. Take a look at what we've got. All right, a J fork. Oh, all right, we'll take it. It's the chat screen. Big portrait of the person you're talking to. These icons represent their patience for this conversation. <laughs> Increases if there are. Uh, if they like you or if they're not particularly busy. Underneath is the portrait, your chat. Try to make small talk. Okay. Sure. Alright, so we've got that. Let's make some small talk. Chat about Provincia. Learned how to maneuver through the management power struggles. Give info. Is there anything to say that you don't already know? Okay. Close this. We'll say goodbye. Alright, so we have a ship now. So I suppose we need to find, try and find some cargo for it, huh? The bank, commodities exchange, mining station, factory. So we worked for these people. Dakindo Incorporated. There's no one there, though. Let's go. Let's go to the spaceport. Well, I guess we were already there. That's us repairing ship. Hi there. Auto ship access joins. Big small talk. Chat about shipment. <clears throat> Chat about the time Lucretia brought a shipment of equipment from Vergi Beaky. All right. Give info. Sea Archer bought Parla Dusty from Termite. Boosts perceived wealth. Alright. Let's do that. Listen to your story when you talk about Felish brought the shipment equipment from Alright. Okay. Can boost our perceived piloting ability. I want, um. I would like to get some cargo or something. Maybe we should just, uh. Let's just go for a fly, shall we? Alright, so how do I get out of here? I don't want these people, I want me. Ships. Board. It's quiet in here at the moment. Yep, that's because it's just me. What is this? Keyboard drive. This is a bad ship hyperdrive. <laughs> So how do I launch? Here we go. Let's go for a fly. You've launched your ship. Use W to thrust or A and D to rotate. All ships fly differently. All right. S is break. Ship will automatically attempt to slow down and stop. If you hold it down, it'll go backwards. All right. A list of all the other ships and objectives in the vicinity. Asteroids. If you click again to bring up the full info screen or click auto on the top left auto fly there once engaged you may click manual see other ships flying around various as nice light lighting will also change depending on the position of the sun oh, that's a nice touch use space to fire your weapons okay your ship's equipped with them don't hit anything well we'll get involved you fly over a gator planet try to interact all right engage to jump through it all right so what do we have we've got an asteroid field 
Not that far away. Let's go there. I don't know if we can do any mining at this point, but let's just check it out and see what we got. I don't know what spec is there. We have no cargo. It's only us here. Story. Oh, here we go. Manual, please. Thank you. Can I interact with this? Alright, looks like I probably don't have um, whatever I need here. Water extraction available. Can rename apparently we can rename everything in this game <laughs> all right so we don't have anything that we can do with this at the moment so we're gonna have to get like components and stuff i wonder if i i should probably um try and buy something need repairs uh-oh oh somebody needs help that's what that is i thought it was us for a second i was like we need repairs i can't i can't help you buddy sorry Sailboat Mangler. It's a terrible bolt gun. Terrible ship engine. Terrible ship engine. Terrible hyperdrive. Alright. Leave ship. Heard about... You heard this. You hear how Vergi has mastered ship repair or tinkering. Alright. Hey there. Alright. Supply wanted goods. Trade ship components. What's on your mind, lady? Needs some interaction with other people. Okay, choose subject. Let's talk about. Uh, let's talk about my sister. Press for info. Ask where she can be found. Tell her about how Princely learned how to maneuver through management power struggles. Harms courage of Provincia. Let's do this one. All right. Um, so that's if we wanted to sell something. Let's chat with this guy. Trade ship components. I'd love to trade ship components, but I don't have any ship in the city that you own. Yes. <laughs> Probably can't uh, can't sell things off of my sister's ship that she's letting me borrow. <laughs> uh, small talk. Give info. This is a story and talk about... Gerald bought foolish newspaper from Miracle Shipyard. I've swapped contact details. Okay. Traded superb money to like. Alright. Just trying to figure out what to do here. Alright, let's stop chatting. We'll go back to the city. Commodities is exchange. Oh, it's all closed now. Well, I guess we'll go home. Where's our home? Your home. There we go. We'll go home. It's 9 p.m. My sister is here. Let's chat with her. Um, what's on your mind, lady? I need some need to sort some things out to improve my situation. Okay, choose subject. Let's talk about. Oh, she's leaving. All right, I guess we'll sleep. It's quiet in here. All right. Alright, so we'll go back to the city here. I need something. Where was the commodities exchange, right? That's what I was thinking about doing. Here. Alright, so we've got... It's a friend of ours. Nathan. Nathan Bysouth. Isn't that my dad's last name? Huh. Um... Trade goods. Oh, so we can buy some goods to take somewhere else and sell. The market contains a number of traders with whom you can trade goods. If you have a ship available, you can chat with a trader to ask to trade. They'll be able to buy and sell goods. All right. So we can buy. We can't buy any of this. It's all too expensive. Let's buy 
two copper ore. Certainly. Certainly. There we go. Now if we go back to the spaceports, we can board our ship. And how do we put, is the cargo on here already? About. I don't want to um, launch without our cargo, but I'm not entirely sure if we have it on here or not. Yes, cargo, two copper ore. All right, so launch. Let's go to the Venusian gate. Auto. There you go. We're going to take it over to Venus and um, try and sell this copper and see if we make some money off of it. This could be a terrible decision. You know, we're figuring this out. Brand new game. Never touched it before. All kinds of interesting things to figure out. I feel like learning to navigate all these um, relationship stuff is going to be key. But I'm not sure how well I'm actually going to be able to do at it. Yeah, it takes a long time. Need a better engine for it. And actually, you know what? I'm actually going to stop here, and we will uh, we'll pick this up next time when we get to Venus, or at least get to the gate. Um, so I am the Criminal Archer. Thanks for joining me. Uh, consider leaving a like if you enjoyed this video. Uh, consider subscribing if you want to see more in the future. And I will see you guys later. Thanks so much.